You leave Daniel out of the game here. This is not about Daniel. I do not impose anything on Daniel. You made us live here among the goats. You complain about the life that you chose. You are not a victim. Not at all. Your generosity conceals something dirtier and meaner. You're incapable of facing your ambitions and you resent me for it, but I'm not the one who put you where you are. I've nothing to do with it. You're not sacrificing yourself, as you say. You choose to sit on the sidelines because you're afraid. Because your pride makes your head explode before you can even come up with the little jam of an idea. And now you wake up and you're 40 and you need someone to blame. And you're the one to blame. You're petrified by your own fucking standards and your fear of failure. This is the truth. You're smart. I know you know I'm right. And Daniel has nothing to do with it. Stop it. You're a monster. Even Daniel says it with his own words. You take that back, you piece of shit. You take He's it back. He's told me countless times how hard you are. Do you know that? He's telling you what you want to hear. He can feel your guilt and he's trying.